It's getting crowded in here. <laughs> birthday earth it's not really the earth's birthday though is it it's just earth day happy day earth <laughs> it's gonna take some getting used to i can't type i am getting reality bites on my netflix tomorrow probably and so i was looking it up to read a little bit about it because i haven't seen it yet i was always typing it as realty bites because I suck at typing, and it, it made me think about what if the movie was about monsters selling real estate. I, I, I made this um, as, a, as a graphic representation um, of <laughs> what, what the movie would be kind of like. It kind of looks like it would be a Pixar movie. I didn't really think that through, although it would be pretty cute if it was a Pixar movie, but... <clears throat> anyway! I just thought that was funny and I had to sketch it. I thought of it yesterday and I tweeted about it last night and then I sketched it today because sometimes I just don't let ideas go. But I guess that's one of the good things about being a writer slash movie interested person is that I don't let ideas go. <laughs> this always makes me sad. I have a drinking problem. Crazy. When I get excited about things on the computer or just in general, I dance around. But it's really funny when it's on the computer because, say, Ben tweets something and it's funny. I will laugh and then I will, like, get up for no reason, dance around the apartment, harass the cats. <laughs> I need a life. Anyway, I've been, like, my ultimate nerd the past few days. I made a music video, which you might have seen because I posted it on here, but I will put a link to that down there in my pants. <laughs> okay, only John and Hank are allowed to say that, because I think that you would like it if you haven't seen it yet. Or maybe you won't like it. Maybe you'll completely hate it. You never know if you like something until you look at it, or taste it, or touch it, or... You know, you never know if you like something unless you experience it. I hope you like it, because it's meant to be liked. <laughs> and it's in celebration of Earth Day, sort of, because I'm out there enjoying nature, and as soon as I finished filming, I looked around for trash and stuff to be picked up. Because whenever I go back into the outdoor woods behind our apartment, I clean up trash if I see it. I like the woods back there. It's Wonderland. I don't want it to be dirty. What would Wonderland be like? if it was dirty. Alice wouldn't be talking to a caterpillar, she'd be talking to a bent can of Budweiser. And that's just depressing. Besides that little bit of creativity, I also went a little bit crazy because I've been on LiveJournal for a really long time, and I always go on there and try to find communities about the people that I love. I went on there and I looked at Ben Stiller, and all there was were some entries mentioning him came up, and a few fake role-playing journals of his came up, his. But there was no Ben Stiller community, and I was like, what? So I, I made a Ben Stiller community. You should go look at it and join it. If you don't have a live journal account, you should make one and join it. <laughs> you don't have to do that, but it would be nice. I think that's everything dorky that I created the past few days, anyway. I created a Chaz Tenenbaum music video. I'll stick that down there, too. I didn't sing that one or play that one. It's a uh, Mountain Goats song, but I created that because I like Chaz Tenenbaum. I've been very creative the past few days. <laughs> I just, I'm kind of surprised that I'm, I've been getting so creative. And I think it's just because there's a lot of, like, obsessed, excited energy within me, and I, I want it to come out. You can tell I'm, I'm a lover, not a fighter, because I seriously do things like this. Punch like a baby. Um, some babies have really hurt me. Do you have any message? <laughs> Your message is shut up, Sarah, isn't it? <laughs>